everyone. Um, happy Friday. Well, if you're watching this after Friday, I hope you're having a good day no matter what day of the week it is. Um, this is a little different from my normal videos. I can't remember if I've done one of these before, but um, not only do I collect jewelry, but um, last year I fell down a tiny rabbit hole of beginning to collect Disney pins. Um, and yeah, I got some pins in the mail today and I have a couple more coming. These, um, the ones that I have to show you today are actual like Walt Disney World or Disneyland, like company pins. The ones that I have coming are fantasy pins. Um, but the ones I have today are actual like legit, like you can trade these in the parks and things and with people, um, on the web. So yeah. Let me show you what I have. Um, so a while ago, I don't know how long ago this was, um, but I came across it last year um, when I was in Disney World and then um, I started collecting them after I had left Disney World. I found this um, mystery bag set of nesting dolls um, that Disney does and they're all Disney princesses and they have like Tinkerbell in there, the three fairies from Sleeping Beauty and Mary Poppins. Those are the only ones that are in there that aren't Disney princesses. Um, but I finally finished the collection. I bought this off of somebody um, on this Facebook group I belong to. I, I belong to too many Facebook groups. It's part of my shopping problem, I guess. <laughs> but um, the one I needed to finish, my nesting doll collection. There are 16 in the collection. And I finally got the last one I needed. Um, it's Princess Anna. Um, and they look, they're so cute. I, I think nesting dolls are like the coolest thing ever. They're a little, um, it's literally like a little nesting doll. Um, it's Princess Anna, and there's Olaf, um, and then on the back, um, it's, like, got the trademark Disney marks. Now, I don't know how to, um, th I know this is a legit pin because I'm a part of this group, and this woman that sells, only sells legit Disney pins, but, um, um, it's got the, like, the Mickey Mouse waffle, and then it has all the logos and stuff. I know there are people out there who can distinguish, um, fakes from real ones, but this one's real. Um, and then this is the backer that stops it. I have mine out on display. I don't wear them. I know a lot of people wear pins, but I have mine out on display. And I don't have a huge collection. But if you ask me, I think I have a big collection because I probably have too many. Um, but I just think they're so cute. I love that one. And then I also ordered um, this bag. Um, I asked the person to surprise me. And in the bags, you can get five different pins in each bag. This is the donut collection. Um, and they're, like, totally random. You don't know which ones you're going to get, obviously, because it's a mystery bag. These are the um, options on the back. Um, I don't really care which ones I get because I want to use these to trade um, for other pins. But this, these are the options, and I just thought it would be fun to open on camera. Now, this is the price you would pay if you got these in the parks. I only paid $10 because this woman that sells these pins, she sells them at a fraction of the cost, which is awesome. Like, I only paid $3.50 or $4.50 for this pin. If you bought a pack of these, it would cost that much. So, I'm going to take that as you go. Um, and I can actually tear it open. I don't know if they're in black baggies. I'm not sure. I don't remember. I know if you buy the boxes where there's only two in a pack, they're in black baggies. Okay, I see the first one. There is it. Here it is. It's Chimney Cricket. Oh, I don't know what this little badge is. Oh, that's part of him. Okay, never mind. And again, there's the waffling on the back, the Mickey waffle, and um, yeah. Okay. Um, I apologize if you don't like these kinds of videos. Um, I just thought it'd be fun to film. Who is this? Okay, I don't know who that is. Let me see. Uh, Mad Hatter, maybe? No. I don't know who that is. Oh, my gosh. Okay, if you know who this is, feel free to comment down below. I don't know what Disney character that is. It's next to Alice in Wonderland, but it's also next to Dumbo. I haven't seen Dumbo in ages, and I haven't seen Alice in Wonderland in a little while, so I don't know. Look, pulling out of these blindly. Oh, look. I have Alice. I really hope that these are tradable. Particularly care for these, but anyway, they're cute though. Um, what does this do? This is the 101 Dalmatian. I can't remember the Dalmatian's name. 
And the last one is Dumbo. Okay. So I'm hoping to trade these because um, I'd like to have some more traders. I don't have a whole lot of pins that I can trade. Um, not this one. This one's for me. This one I'm keeping. But the rest of them I'm going to trade. So yeah, um, that's it. I um, Again, I'm sorry if you didn't like this video. I know I haven't done my November favorites, but I don't really have a lot of jewelry that I wore in November. I mean, I wore jewelry every day, but I kind of wore the same stuff every day. Um, but I'll make a video if you want to see a video. Um, I might do that tomorrow. Okay, thanks so much for watching. And oh, oh, um, this is my first video of 2019. So happy new year. Um, take care. I'll see y'all later. Bye.